Hi everyone, welcome back to Code Dias. In this particular video, I'll going to talk about function returning another function concept. The topic name is observe very carefully function returning another function. See, that means what previously we know that key inside function we can return values normal value we can return so we can return 10 20 30 40 like this so here instead of value what we will going to return we will going to return a functions basically right just to have a look once so suppose i have a function def suppose outer suppose the function name is outer and inside this functions i will going to write simply print um, hello outer hello outer hello outer next and after that i'm going to create one more function called as inner called as inner and here inside this inner i will going to write a hello inner hello inner and then after that i will going to write here one print statement print um, something like called as simply i will to print a few dots okay few dots i'm going to print Next, I will going to write a return, return inner, return inner. So, if you will observe very carefully, I created a function. I created a function. Next, inside this function, I have a print statement. Then, if you will observe very, very carefully, this is a nested function. So, this is a nested function. So, inside that function, so we return print a hello inner. Then, this is a normal statement. You can write anything, okay? Next and after that, what we are returning here? We are not returning 10, 20, 30, 40. We are returning, we are returning what? A function. We are returning a function. Inner function, we are returning. Right. So now I will going to call outer function. Now we will going to call outer function. So now guys, tell me, just pause this video and tell me what is the output? What output you can expect? Simply observe very carefully. Observe very carefully. Yeah, fine. Simply the program executions will start from here. So we are calling outer functions means the control will go to outer functions. Then go inside. It will going to print what? Hello, hello, outer, hello, outer. Next, here this is a function. It will not going to execute. Then go to here. It will going to print a few dots. Next and after that, what? It will going to return? It will going to return this functions. It will going to return this inner functions basically. But we are not storing anywhere or something like. So as of now, what output I will get? As of now, tell me what output I will get. So simply I will get hello outer, hello outer, then few dots. Okay. Hello outer, then few dots. Getting or not? Hello outer, few dots we are getting basically. Oh, fine, sir. Right. Now what I will going to do? I will going to write uh, x is equals to x is equals to outer. That means what? Whenever we are calling outer functions, uh, it will going to print a hello outer. Then it will going to print a few dots. Uh, then what? It is returning inner function. It is returning what? Uh, inner functions. That means uh, if I will call to x, if I will call to x, uh, then what exactly it will going to print? Uh, it will going to print a uh, hello inner it will going to print a hello inner just observe just observe observe now let me discuss let me discuss let me discuss it diagrammatically execution start from here control will go to here it will go here and it will going to print a hello outer okay now hello outer fine any doubt no next and after that uh, it will going to print a few dots any doubt no Next and after that, it is returning what? Inner function. It is returning what? Inner function. That is stored inside X. Whenever you are calling X function, X function means inner function. X function means a inner function. So basically, so whenever you are calling X function, control will go to here and it will going to print what? Hello inner. Hello inner. Hello inner. So if I am going to call X three more times, so hello inner, hello inner, hello inner, you will get. I hope it is clear. Fine. Right, sir. So I will write one more time, sir. That is X. That is X. Getting now? Any doubt? No doubt. It's no. It's very clear cut information, I can say. 
very clear cut information so this is how you can return one functions basically okay so uh, previously i already told you that key we cannot call inner functions outside of outer functions we already completed but this is the way by using this way you can call inner functions outer side of outer functions okay so generally okay now this is the way this is the way you can call out it this is the way to call inner functions outside of outer functions we are calling inner functions indirectly we are calling inner functions indirectly basically right so that's clear cut information so so what exactly uh, happening inside memory or something like observe whenever you are calling outer functions so suppose outer functions are created outer functions are created so outer is pointing to this one next and after that uh, observe whenever we are returning inner whenever we are returning inner suppose inner inner is pointing to this one now x is equal to outer outer is returning what inner that means x also pointing to same inner same inner functions right or not so that means you can call inner functions you you can call inner functions with the name of inner inside outer functions if you want to call outside of outer functions you have to use x what i'm saying observe very carefully what i'm saying ki this is outer functions inside this outer functions if you want to call inner functions you can call like this right but if you want to call outside of outer functions you can call with the help of x same function will execute or not yes same function will execute so that is what very simple clear cut information so i'll move towards one more example so that you will get more clarity this is example number 1 so i'll move towards one more example is actually okay fine so another example is what i'll going to write def fon1 def fon1 and uh, inside this i'll going to write uh, uh, something like return 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 fon2 return fon2 basically return fon2 or return something like args ax or return x return x and here i'll going to write a x return x i'll going to write x and i'll going to write a def x and i will going to write a printer python something like now observe very carefully my function name is what x here and this is a function which is a name as something like a fon1 and this fon1 is returning what x x means uh, this is a function na uh, right basically observe 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 now i will going to call fon1 now i will going to call fon1 by passing by passing something like called as x something like called as x so you can write here anything just like abc also no issue and return abc okay now you have to tell what output you expect now you have to tell what output you expect basically observe the carefully observe the carefully yeah so we are calling which functions of fon fon1 and what we are passing this functions we are passing and this functions will store inside abc and return abc means uh, this fon1 is returning what x functions na this fon1 is returning what x functions what output you will get you will get a blank screen you will get a blank screen basically why because whenever you are calling fon function control go to here and inside abc so we are passing what x x is a function right or not so abc means what x functions returning what abc means it is returning fon1 is returning x functions fon1 is returning x functions basically and we are not storing any here so that's why we are not get any kind of output have a look once blank screen but if i will store inside a data or any variable data and if i will call data then i will get what python python yes python right or not so observe very carefully na observe very carefully we are calling fun function control will go to here and we are passing what x x is a functions this functions abc means what x functions returning abc means what it is returning x functions so that means data means what x functions basically right or not x functions basically 
so if you are calling data means so we are calling x functions we are calling x functions okay and see here a b c x data all are same only <laughs> all are same only or not see here it is a x functions okay here it is a x functions so a b c means also pointing to same x so x means sorry data means the same also pointing to x okay if you will print all the address then you will get more clarity okay so here i will going to print id of id of abc okay id of abc i will going to write here what the abc id abc id okay abc id now i will going to copy this one i will going to write x x id x id so this is x uh oh sorry i have done small mistake huh? observe 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 yeah so something like i'll going to write uh, abc id abc id is uh, abc id is uh, id of uh, abc that's it next and after that here x uh, id is a uh, comma id of uh, x okay fine sir next and after that uh, copy uh, data id data data id is a uh, id of data so what my intention is what i am saying ki abc x data all are same all are same pointing to same memory location have a look once just observe abc is pointing to same memory location data is pointing to same memory location and uh, 27 point something like is pointing to same memory location that's it thank you we'll meet in the next video thank you so much